Hi guys and welcome back. So today I'm going to show you guys five surprisingly easy ways to style your hair this summer. And a big thank you to our friends at Revlon for collabing with me on this tutorial. And if you're new to this channel, hi, I am Tina. So let's get started. All right, so first, let me show you guys the easiest way to curl your hair overnight and what to use in your shower to protect your color from fading in the hot summer months. But I basically use color shampoos with tints in them like all year round. So here's what I'm using right now, the Color Silk Shampoo and Conditioner in the shade Gorgeous Brunette. But I showed you guys how I use this product a couple of weeks ago in my how to, well, how I color my own hair at home. So if you miss it, I'll link it down below. But basically I just use the shampoo like any other shampoo. And sometimes you can be silly and do shampoo hairstyles on yourself. And then I follow up with the conditioner and I leave this in for about two to five minutes. And I want to tell you guys, aside from the color protecting benefit of using this, I really love the color of this on me. Now, 99% of the time I go with the purple shampoo because we all know that neutralizes the brassiness. But I want to tell you guys, try this shade. It's going to give you the most beautiful, rich, caramelly hair color while neutralizing your brassy tone. So if you guys want to try these out, this line comes in four shades and each shade was formulated with natural ingredients, which I'll list on the screen for you right here. But the one I use has almond oil in it and I love the way it smells and I love how long lasting it is because I hate shampoos and conditioners that makes your hair smell like nothing, if you know what I mean. And you can find these at your hair dyeing aisle, at your local Walmart and other drugstores. So go check this out. And as for the easiest heatless curls ever, we're simply going to divide our hair in half and make a French braid on each side. But if you can't French braid your own hair, just do a normal braid, you'll get the same result simply with less volume. That's all it is. And make sure you're not doing this on soaking wet hair, otherwise it's going to take forever to dry this. And in about six hours, you can remove the braids to get these really beautiful beach waves. Now for this second hairstyle, I am wearing my brown hair extension because this hairstyle just looks better with long hair. And I did use the Color Silk Shampoo and Conditioner on it as well, so match my hair color. But do you guys notice how shiny my hair is? It is insane. So here's how to do an easy and my favorite fancy half updo this year. So first, you're going to tease the back of your crown, section out your bangs, and clip away the crown. And then take your side sections and put them into a ponytail before flipping it twice. And once you flip them twice, pull out the sides to make it look thicker. And then create another ponytail with the top section before making one big ponytail with these two ponytails. And lastly, we're going to just wrap some hair around the elastic band and we're done. And hairstyle number three is everyone's favorite two minute elegant bun, a new way to do it. We're going to make a ponytail, flip it, and then make a simple braid before tying the ends. Next, we're going to pull out the sides to make it a little fuller. And then we're going to hairspray the braid, wait for it to dry, and then roll the braid into a bun before pinning everything down and that's all there is to it. And here's the lazy girl's fancy ponytail. We're going to clip off the top and put the rest into a low ponytail before wrapping some hair around the elastic band. Next, take the top section, 
twist it around the ponytail before pinning it around the elastic band and that's all there is to it. And lastly, this is going to be another really, really easy updo. So we're going to divide out our hair in half and clip away the top. And then with the bottom section, we're going to make two small buns. And by the way, guys, if you have thin hair, this hairstyle is amazing for you because it makes your bun look really thick at the end. So anyway, so after you make your two small buns, you're going to divide out the top in half again and then start wrapping it around these two buns. And we're done. If you guys enjoyed all of these hairstyles, enough to try them out this summer. And big thanks again to Revlon for teaming out with me on this video. Please be sure to thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll see you guys again next weekend. I love you guys. Have a beautiful hair day, everyone. Bye.